All right, welcome back. This is M Dog. We're doing something a little different here. We've actually got my leveling account here, as you normally see. But to do a little fun testing here, uh, in the top left-hand corner, you should be able to see my alternate account as well. Now, this isn't my main account. That wouldn't be fair. But this is my alternate account, which is level 29 using full bonus and pickers and uh, 7.8 fluorocarbon line. Other than that, it's about the same. We're using uh, size 8 hooks, which I think I might have a couple of 6 hooks on my main uh, screen here. And garlic dough on all, as well as 20 meters clipped on all three. So we're going to kind of be going back and forth here. Let me move my mic so you can hear me a little better when I'm catching fish on this account over here. Um, this is actually what I do a lot when I'm streaming, is I'll get a second account going, especially if I'm fishing at a pretty slow, like fishing for carp or sturgeon or something on my main account. A lot of times we'll get the second account going. So let me move my mic. This should um, this should pick me up a little bit better regardless of which, which one I'm fishing from. So we'll see how this goes comparating, uh, comparatively speaking. I mean, the... The reason why the alt account may, of course this will be a small sample size, but if it does do a little better, I mean it's got some more skill points in it. It's got those bonus and rods, which are going to get a little bit of a bonus towards trophies, supposedly. Um, but other than that, it should be fair game across the board. This also will slow you down a little bit, because I'm not catching them as fast obviously so we've got the, you, you actually <laughs> in a spot like this that's pretty active it's kind of fun because you, you basically just move back from account to account and you'll just about have fish on all the time so uh, on this account we tend to keep all the fish because we need all the silver we can get so I will keep that small little bream if you saw the video I put up before this one um, I thought it was going to show the actual disconnect message in the video, but it didn't. So I, I did lose internet connection, connection there as I was bringing in what possibly could have been a trophy bream. Maybe, maybe, maybe from this spot. So this spot seems really good right now. It's still a little early as it is, what, 1930 right now. But we should see some pretty nice fish coming in, as long as I don't get disconnected or called away to do something for work. Uh, I guess the other thing to mention is we are using True Bream, Bream Mix over here. Um, which if we catch too many fish, we might run out. I don't know if I have the ingredients to make it or not. We'll have to check. I want to check this... Uh, yeah, I could tell this one was pulling out a little bit. So let's go ahead and get this one in real quick. Then I'll come catch these other fish on the main account. As you can see, you know, by the time you get the fish in over here, <laughs> the board is lit up on the other account. This is a nice bream right here, though. 3.4. So good reason to um, start bream fishing pretty early. All right, which one's struggling the most? This one's bouncing the most, so let's go ahead and take this one out of its misery. Uh, sounds like... Sounds like um, that third one is pulling. So I don't know what the drag is on, but... That was pretty low. Okay, so we're good. We're good. Yeah, this is going to be a hectic video. I can tell already. It's 20.00, and we're already, like, dancing back and forth between the two accounts. Don't be surprised here if I lose a couple fish off of hooks, because I will be um, reeling in a little more aggressively than normal. And I already am... Uh, using pretty cheap hooks over here on this 
leveling account, as you know. Someone is asking, where are you fishing? Hopefully they have noticed that we are using two accounts because it can look like all of a sudden we're pulling in just fish one after another in chat if you don't notice the different names. So we are at 31.33 at Old Berg on two accounts. Alright, let's see what's going on over here. We've got these blinkers on, so it's no noise bothering me when there's fish on over here. Um, so I just kind of have to glance over and see if anything's lit up. Of course, that'll get easier as it gets darker. Oh, I didn't answer what bait. What quadrant on the map is that? I'm trying to keep one of these. A little more to the left. Let's see. Uh, what quadrant on the map? It's at about D7. All right. More fish. promise I won't normally do this uh, I don't think I won't I won't promise that I'll never do it again but I don't normally fish with two accounts when I'm making a video so I was really curious though I, I, I wanted to see using real bream ground bait which of course we are on the alternate account if uh, at the end of a night it would be um, significantly better. Still seeing a lot of smaller ones come in. That should be changing soon. probably ought to switch this middle line over here on the leveling account. I probably ought to switch that back to a size 8 hook. And over course of time, I think 8 is going to be more ideal than a 6. Alright, let's see what we've got on. It's a little harder to carry on the conversation talking as much when you're reeling in fish after fish. But it's exciting. I, I So when I'm streaming and I have a second account up like this, I don't, um, I don't often fish two spots that are this active. This actually gets a little tiring after a while. Um, But like I said, if my main account is on something a little more slow, just waiting on the big hit from big fish to hit, like a big carp or something, or what is that? I thought that was a common roach. Um, then I might stick my uh, other account, my alternate account, in a spot like this one or a nice bream spot or something, just to keep that money coming in, and uh, also try to be a little more entertaining instead of just sitting there waiting on a common carp to get on. It's also been nice to test spots out with a few more lines in the water at times. We'll stay on this account and get this one and then we'll switch over. We do have some, at least a couple of fish on waiting. I think three actually. Now we're late enough that we're starting to see pretty good rate of keepers now, I think. 
Oh, not official on that one. I guess we just never tightened it up. It looked like it was one of those where they'd taken off right towards the the pole, but that is not the case. And I would say so far, our substitute bream ground bait and our lower level account with less skill points has done just as well. At least that's my impression. Let's check really quick. Yeah, we do have green ground bait. That's good. Now this is where it gets tricky. To catch a fish with one count and make ground bait on the other one. This has a fish on. And now let's get back to seeing what's going on over there. Yeah, we got fish on over there too. All right. It's too bad we can't make um, fish pieces yet on this account. <clears throat> we really do need to level up bait crafting. When you are bream fishing, you get so many bream around that 500 gram mark, five to 700 gram mark that aren't markers, but serve the really nice purpose of leveling up bait crafting and giving you fish pieces. But until you get to 50%, you just can't do that. Holy moly. I need to turn the volume up over here. I can't. There we go. Now I can hear it. I don't have an excuse if I start losing fish over here. I've got nice hooks. The error is a user error if it happens over here. Or it could be an impatience error, I guess you could argue, but... That is a trophy, folks. Okay, so <laughs> the first trophy comes in pretty quickly, and it was on the, uh, the higher level account with all the skill points and bonus and rods and all that. So for what that's worth, I love having binoculars, but it's just too much silver to justify spending on our free-to-play account that's still leveling up. There's a lot we need before we can go purchase binoculars. Oh man, I need to recast that one, but let's catch these fish first. It would be interesting if we had a trophy on over here, if they had both gotten on at the same time. I kind of want to check that third rod. I get nervous when I see something just bent down like that. You just don't know when it's about to snap. Uh, okay. We're okay. <laughs> We're okay. It's a nice one. It's not a trophy, but it was a nice one. Yeah, I probably ought to touch that friction break down a little bit since we're not going to be able to get to these lines. Ooh, goodness, my other account now has some lines freaking out over there. That's a smaller one. All right, let's see what's going on. This one's having conniptions. And the other side, the first one is just pulling good. Yeah, that middle line over here on the uh, smaller smaller view account 
is uh, needs to be recast desperately. If there's not a fish on right now, we just need to reel that in and recast it. Because it's just been sitting there like that for a while. It's a pretty nice fish. Getting farther and farther right with these casts. I want to try to stay disciplined with at least one of them. More to the... Um, the left side there. So this is not the most efficient fishing as you can tell. I mean, yeah, you never have a dull moment, but you do have fish sitting on the line a little longer, which is why once I've unlocked loop rigs, I feel a little bad, a little better about it. All right, we're going to grab this one real quick. And I'll tell you what. Oh, shoot. I don't have premium on either of these accounts, so I can't send him garlic dough. These fish are biting so fast. I know I haven't picked one up off the main, off my bigger account over here, but it's like they just keep biting over here. If you uh, have not leveled your bait crafting to at least garlic dough, it is worth the little bit of time and silver it'll take you. It's not very hard to get it to that point. The higher you go, the harder it gets. Um, but I've, I have, uh, at this point, there's so many baits you can craft, it's really not that bad. And I've taken couple accounts to um, much higher than that myself and, and even that's not too terrible but all right let's see what's going on So sad what happened at uh, Notre Dame today. And I really haven't even heard the sort of final commentary on it. I just know that a lot of damage was done in the fire. over there I think we've got two maybe three fish on but yeah as soon as we recast this middle line we start we start catching more fish on it I and mean, we start catching fish on it again Got it in. So what do you think? That first one's a little bit more strenuous. Yeah.
The other thing that gets easy to do when you're going back and forth this quickly is forget to switch ground bait when you need to. All right. Wow. This fish took it way off to the west here. So what time is it? 2.47. Could we get a second trophy in the same night? On this account or just in general? Okay, I hear something. Where is that? It's coming out of my ear, isn't it? Yeah. So that is... It's got to be that third line, which... Ooh, it's pulling good. Hold on. Okay, hold on. There's no ground bait on this. Yeah, this is where it gets to be a difficulty here. All right. Okay, we're okay. Let's see what that looks like. That looks like a common carp. So here's the deal. This might be what that was when I got disconnected. It might not have been a bream at all. That is a possibility. Wow, we're almost out of garlic. Uh, garlic there. We're almost out of um, ground bait. All right, we got to get these. Holy cow. I guess I didn't really think through this. This this spot is a little too active for me to try to do two counts. <laughs> we just got constant fish on. Caught 27 over here and 23 over there, and we've definitely left fish just sitting there for a while on both. So both would have had probably a couple more fish each, but we've done okay. Let's just get some ground bait on here real quick. Anything will do. Let's see what can we do this. At this point, I'm not even sure I'm casting to the right spots. It's a pretty good chance I'm not, actually. It's a pretty nice one. Yeah, the only thing I don't love about this spot is when they run to the left, you got to pull them in over that rock. But first world problems, right? Whew. Just grab this one real quick. Yeah, I'm glad we did. <laughs> this is another, uh, certainly over two kilos, I would say. Yeah, it's got some nice coloration on there. Not trophy, but a really nice one. 3.7. We'll take that. Okay, let's see what we got going on. Without realizing it, we are itching ever closer to um, level 18 over here. I don't know 
if that fish is really on yet. Mm. It is now, isn't it? So, I mean, we can do a comparison here in just a little bit when we finish, but I do feel like we're probably getting a little bit larger fish over here on the higher level account with the skill points, with the legitimate um, bream ground bait. It probably is mattering a little bit. Uh, again, too small of a sample size to say anything definitive. Um, I think that's probably the case. Not only the trophy, but just in general, a little bit higher average on weight is what it feels like to me. Here's a small one. As we get past 5 a.m., the smaller ones will start working their way back into the mix a little more often. Ooh, that was such a nice hit there. where we start reeling so aggressively and you can feel that you can hear that line getting pulled just a little bit on that third rod and I think I'm more comfortable with this fish over on the smaller account or the smaller screen account hanging out a little bit longer let's go ahead and see what's going on with this one yeah we're fine I just didn't want to It's got a little weight to it. A little hard to lift. Now it's coming in nice. Well, a small miracle, but no fish have gotten away yet. All right, we are really getting low on ground bait here. Actually, we could go pearl. Uh, whatever, it doesn't matter. Holy cow. Okay, hold on. This is a bouncy fish, whatever it is. All right, let's get off of here. Let's see if I can do this one-handed. It is taking a chance on what may be a pretty decent fish. Uh, all right, that is over three kilos, isn't it? Yeah, 3.2, another nice one. All right, let's get this one back in the water here. Right, this is line two, so let's put that there. Okay. Well, I don't want to jinx myself, but we haven't lost any fish yet. Oh, this line on this account always gets the larger ones and they always feel larger because it's the smallest rig, but All right. I think that fish on the first line is the one that's been waiting a minute, right? Wasn't he? <laughs> just got a 
Crucian Carp over here. The bites are still coming in really fast. Across the board. But they're getting smaller too. Smaller and weirder. Crucian Carp, I'm looking at you. When will the first roach of the morning come in? I don't know which one to pull in first over here. This is the weakest one, so maybe this one makes sense to pull in first. Oh, I left this sitting on 24 break. That's a good way for something not pleasant to happen. Well, total number of fish, this account is still winning. Quality of the bream, I suspect the other account is pretty far ahead, but we'll see. Might be closer than I think if you take the trophy out. But why would you take the trophy out? I mean, it's 710. We'll get, we'll try to go to close to 9 a.m. I guess. Just in case we get a late, a late trophy. late one I've noticed on this alternate account the one that I don't normally show on these videos it's um, with the bream ground bait I mean fish are getting on so fast even just that account I can hardly get them all reeled in before another one's on one of the lines I've definitely had fish holding on longer over there since I don't have a bell in my ear reminding me. Yeah, we have died off completely on this account, it looks like, in terms of catching the good ones. Let's check this first rod to see if there's anything on there. Dang. Somebody just called it a nice bream. Way to go, Blueby. 5.9. Why do I have a feeling that's at Volkov? We will uh, do a little stalking of Blueby real quick. Just a second. Oh, I hear that line again. Yeah, so there you call it a common roach. That feels like he might be using night crawlers to me. Although it could be off of anything. fish in. This is a decent one. I think that one's going to be more than two, right? Mm, not quite. Wishful thinking.
So, level 24. Uh, his bream hasn't shown up yet. Oh, wait. Garlic dough at Volkov. Was that it? 5.64? No, 5.92. Okay, that's what we need to look at. It hasn't registered yet. It takes a minute to pop up everywhere. That would surprise me a little bit if a trophy that size came in on garlic dough at Volkov. I mean, anything is possible, but... Yeah, the fish are still nice over here on the alternate account. Wow, oh, this is awkward. Almost made it up on the shore there. All right, it's 920. Let's we'll stop throwing lines back in. Okay. Is that even a marker? That's a gibble. I need to remember to make some more ground bait before we come out here again on this account. We are so close to level 18, though. And uh, we just made some more decent silver here. All right. So, what a night. Um, even on this account. 17 over a kilo i mean just a fantastic night of bream fishing um, for a level 17 free to play account and um over here we've got 7, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20 over a kilo, so a little better, and many more in the top line, over, over two kilos. We didn't catch any bream over two kilos on the other account, and that may be where things like those bonus and rides, um, or the actual bream ground bait versus the sub green ground bait, that may be where those things make a difference, or just could be RNG. I mean, like I said in the beginning of this, this is a very small sample size for what we're doing. Can we possibly get an auto walk feature? I mean, heck, there could be one and I just don't know it, actually. I could have forgotten about it. But if there's not, auto walk or auto run in this game would be pretty cool, I think. All right, let's check our cafe orders here. Unlucky in terms of the bream, but that's okay. It's interesting how far down the list that common carp is. It was just a very small common carp. So 84 silver for not much, not much time uh, and some very fun fishing. And that will put us up to what, 240 silver? Something like that. We will take that. I guess you probably can't see that amount, right? Bloop. If I knew I was gonna fish a little longer on this account, I would maybe hold on to that trophy for a little while, but the trophy bream order was up earlier today at Oldberg, if I remember correctly, I saw it, so we're not going to worry about it. Let's see how we did. 
So we did 45 silver on that trophy bream by itself for a total of 160 silver. So we doubled. We doubled up on the account with a higher skill ceiling and uh, better gear and all that. So um, that is that. And bye bye to the other account. So, Old Berg, that spot is still really nice. If you are uh, looking for a good bream spot, I, I really recommend that one. Let's see if we can see anything else about Bluebee's uh, fish there, if it's had time to... So, I think it would show up here if it was at Old Berg, although... Yeah, it's still showing as 5.6. It'll show up later, though. It will show up later. Okay. Well, as always, thanks for watching. And uh, if this fishing with two accounts was too annoying, I apologize. But uh, I have fun, although it was chaotic being uh, two spots that active. Um, but anyway, thanks for hanging out, and I will see you next time.